Now to a public meeting for the TriMet Board of Directors. It got so heated at one point today, it had to move from a closed room session instead. And that's after a large group of people showed up to protest fare increases. We the people want to vote! We the people want to vote! Well, the board did vote six to one in favor of those increases. Jenny Young was at that meeting as it became heated, and she joins us live now. Jenny, must have been a sight to see. It was. It was a long meeting, a lot of energy, a lot of frustration. Board members actually left twice. The first time was right after the group got there and got a little too noisy. Then they came back, uh, tried to start the meeting again, and it just didn't work. What do we want? Free I'm out here because, A, I think that transit should be free in Portland. Um, and I'm also opposing the transit increase that TriMet is voting on today. Protesters marching from South Waterfront headed for a TriMet Board of Directors meeting to demand their voices be heard. We the people want to vote! Board President Linda Simmons giving a warning to the group before deciding to move the meeting online. We're going to continue and I'm going to speak next. And if any one of you opens your mouth, we're going virtual. continuing their meeting in the next room behind closed doors manned by two security guards. Protesters surrounding the door and calling board members cowards. Coward. Six of seven board members voting in favor to increase the cost of rides. Starting January 1st of 2024, adult tickets and paratransit tickets will increase to $2.80. Honored citizen and youth tickets will increase to a buck 40. We are already struggling with like a, a, a lot of going on after pandemic. And Abby, who relies solely on TriMet for transportation, including getting to and from her job, tells me while a 30 cent increase might not seem like a lot, it adds up, especially when you're already struggling to pay bills. Rent is so high and also like food is so expensive and people live check, paycheck to paycheck. We are already paying transit through our tax. So TriMet says that this, of course, again, will not increase until January 1st of 2024. They say they have not done a rate increase um, in a decade, and this money will go towards operating costs. Reporting live, Jenny Young, Coin 6 News. Let's talk about the weather. Liz, 